What up, loved ones? What it do? It's Pate Young right here. You know where I'm from. Thanks for tuning in. And if you're new to this channel right here, just hit the subscribe button real quick. Give it a like if you think it's cool, if you think it's real. So right now, man, as you can see, I'm over here flexing my girl. <laughs> yeah, so basically, I just wanted to uh, share my story real quick. As far as my perspective before when I was doing time in the pen, to uh, how I feel about things that is going on right now. Uh, yeah, sure. You got a lot of other rappers or a lot of um, a lot of other folks that be flexing their girl, or should I say, girls, two girls, three girls at the same time. But I mean, think about it. Uh, for me, one girl. I mean, just look at her, look how beautiful her face is. I mean, it's not it's not just about the face, because yeah, of course. I mean, we're all superficial at one point. It's all about the looks, but it's just way it's more than that. Um, yeah, I mean, you can have three girls at the same time, but what about the quality? Because for me, one real girl, like the one that I'm with right now, is worth more than a million hoes. I, I think I've said this before. Uh, you know what I mean? You can't, you, you can't beat that. Uh, I've been through some other girls before when I first got out I used to I used to be like I'm not gonna go I'm not gonna go hang out or stick with just one girl for what I mean <laughs> but uh, this one is different because uh, how okay let me tell you how um, first and foremost there wasn't gonna be no para young if she didn't buy the my uh the what did you buy again ring light. the ring light and the little microphone uh she pushed me through uh push through to to my idea of um doing parayang and uh man i mean yeah that, that's a good thing somebody that's pushing you to do better uh what more can you ask for because usually you get toxic girls that are just like pulling you down on, on, on negativity so that's a huge plus for me right there and what else she basically pretty much left a uh in, in 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 long story short she chose me over money because she, she she already had it good she was already with a billionaire guy uh this guy right here i mean you know he is he is he, he doesn't he's not long he's not ugly or whatever anything like that or old he's basically my 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 age you know I'm 32 by the way but I mean it's, she still chose me why perhaps that she saw something in me that uh, that the other guy didn't have you know I don't know what it was is it because of the, the G shit the gangster shit or because the other guy was a pussy snitch 911 dialer I, I don't know I don't know guys I'm not here I'm not a relationship expert all I can say is it doesn't hurt to be a man of your word if you say something you just gotta have to do it by action otherwise no one's gonna believe you your word would basically pretty much mean nothing it's like you're saying a lot of words uh, it ain't I'm not glorifying uh, you gotta be a gangster to get to get the girls you gotta be a that's not even like that because nowadays you got 6 9 you got snitch 9 you got all these wannabe gangsters on the rap video promoting glorifying gang banging now there's nothing so i don't want to condone that this i don't want anybody to get the wrong idea it's just that being a man of your word meaning uh just you know whatever you said you just come through with that you know uh the girl the girls they're gonna know anyways and they're gonna choose whoever they want to choose <laughs> I'm alright, you're probably thinking like, yeah, whatever, nigga. Yeah, yeah whatever, nigga, I'm gonna eat this pizza. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so, uh, yeah. Uh, when, I, when I got out, basically, after doing 13 years, to those who don't know, if you're new to the channel, uh, I've been through a lot of other superficial and shallow relationships, basically. Like, things here, things there, but it wasn't as as deep as you can say as how deep this is watch your mouth <laughs> yeah yeah 
Uh, yeah, man. So uh, for me, right there, I'm not the type of um, uh, man. Also, that um, just gonna leave anybody behind. I don't even leave homies behind. Why would I leave a, a, a innocent girl behind? I, I don't. I don't get down like that. I don't need no two, two or three girls at the same time to make me feel like I'm a man or I'm, I'm a handsome dude or whatever. Uh, you know, to the real ones, y'all, y'all can relate, man. All you need is a one real one. And that should be good enough. And you just gotta be, um, I mean, you just gotta be happy. Because otherwise, if you're not happy or content, then I don't know what else to say. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so uh, there it is. When I got out, uh, I, I spoke to a lot of people. I mean, uh, don't get me wrong. She know the business. All my homies will tell you that knows me here knows the business. I got like a 99.9% accuracy of a hit or miss. I would hit whoever I come up, whoever I come up to. And I will hit you. Too. And she will hit me right here. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, man. Uh, I don't know what else to say. Uh, I'm going. I'm going with this girl. Um, Y'all can y'all y'all can say whatever you want to say. Uh, actually, right now I got a lot of homies start to be talking shit. Like, hey, buddy, you just did 13 years. You just got out. Uh, just a couple years, and you over there just hanging out with uh, one girl. You ain't pimping like me. You ain't no player like me. I got different hoes every day. You can have that. You really think like you can pull girls better than me? Then that's all you. You know what I mean? You just shot that. Uh, that's all I wanted to say, man. Cause. Right here in this channel, man, I know it might be boring, but because we're promoting, um, uh, right here we're promoting honor and principle as a man, being a man of your word. It might not be the cool thing that's going on here in the real world, but this is what I'm pushing. And uh, integrity and principles, we're going to make it still cool in today's day and age. This is what's all about, man. You know, uh, I mean, being a G or being a pussy. Which one do you choose? But uh, uh, by, by any chance, I'm not promoting um, gangsterism or anything like that, being a gang member or a gangster, because it's all watered down anyways. It's all boo-boo. What you see in the music rap video, there's one to be gangsters on TV, but ends up going to PC anyways and going to snitch anyways when they go to prison. It's, just be a man of your word. That's, that's all I got to say. And, you know, uh... <clears throat> What else can I say? Tell us about your other uh, uh, billionaire dude. Ah! <laughs> yeah, man. So how many girls do you know that, that, that will do that? They will choose somebody that's not even yet for sure that you're going gonna, gonna, to gonna have a lot of money or somebody that already has for sure, for sure, a lot of money. Which one do you choose? And how many girls do you actually know out there that would do that for you. So how can I just leave her hanging? Uh, we don't get down like that. Uh, I told her before, uh, you know, I don't wanna, um, what do you call this? Be a hindrance to whatever it is that you wanna do. Uh, by all means, it's, you know, and uh, she chose to stay. Cheers! <laughs> But yeah, so uh, do you have anything to say to the viewers about, you know, finding the right girl if they want to, uh, they want to just have the real one or they want a gang of fucking superficial uh, stuff? Oh my gosh, I'm not prepared for this question and answer portion. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> We're, this is how we do it here at Yang. We just basically just go with the flow because we, be, we want it to be as real and raw as possible. No scripted, none of that stuff. We're not celebrities. We're just like real people, you know. So all well, I can well, say is, don't be superficial and materialistic. You can feel it in your heart if you find someone that is really, you know, your destiny or something. But that's what I felt before when I met him. Yeah, hold on, man. I gotta, <laughs> I gotta get that. Yeah.
So uh, there you go, guys. Uh, once again, man, uh, just look at the bright side. I know we're all going through a lot of things right now, heartbreak, financial, uh, whatever it is that you guys are going through, man. Uh, just look at the bright side. Bright side, count your blessings, be strong, be a warrior. Warrior means you have no fear, fate over fear. What else can we say? There goes another episode of Pari Young. Thank you for watching. And with that being said, you'll know what time it is. Say what you mean and mean what you say because real recognize real. Yeah, I'm out of here, man. Thanks.